West of Stafford, these strange rings are part of a massive climate change experiment. These trees are living in the future, and that's because the big metal rings are pumping out CO2, the climate change gas, to achieve the kind of levels we're going to see globally in about 50 years' time. And the big question is, what impact will all that CO2 have on these Staffordshire trees? And now the first results from this University of Birmingham experiment are in, and it tells us the trees are sucking up the extra CO2. And that's all thanks to one scientist and her very bulky but very clever machine. So what we can do is we can clamp the machine onto the leaf and then here you can see all of the different parameters that we can measure from the CO2 to the, the temperature, the light. So what we have found is that the trees increase their photosynthesis or their carbon uptake by around 30% in response to that raised CO2 levels. But of course, it's the canopy, the leaves at the top, that you need to study here. And so that's where I'm going. So here we are at the top of the tree canopy. It's a little bit windy, moving quite a lot. And this is where researchers will spend up to 14 hours a day analysing and sampling what's going on here at the top of these trees. And remember, they're doing it with those big pieces of experimental equipment we saw down on the ground. There are so many experiments here measuring the flow of sap through the trees, the growth of the trees, leaf fall, even cameras in the soil itself. So this is just the first result of many that will go to explain a very complex picture. Are these trees going to keep that carbon that they've captured, that we've shown they've captured, or are they going to spend it in other ways? Are they going to spend it on defence against pests and diseases? Maybe they'll put it in the soil and stimulate other organisms. So, so there's lots of different ways that that carbon can be used and we're only just starting to understand that. And of course, rising CO2 levels are just one part of the overall climate change picture. But what we learn from this patch of Staffordshire oaks will give us valuable insight into the climate change future we will all one day live in. David Gregory Kumar, BBC Midlands Today, near Stafford.